Okay, Coach, what was your biggest take of the uh, championship weekend for the NFL? Well, the two big surprises, number one, six seconds ago, you got the ball in the 50-yard line, and lo and behold, you let a receiver get behind you. That was the difference in the football game. The other thing that really shocked me, Mark, you're down by eight. You have fourth down on the four-yard line, and you kick the field goal. I mean, I felt for sure they would go for it on fourth down and try to tie the game up. If they didn't make it on fourth down, they would have had them backed up. Uh, the Bucks would have been backed up. They would have had to run the football, and you'd have got the ball about midfield with maybe two minutes to go to the game. So that really surprised me. What I took out of the weekend is a little bit bigger picture. When I look at all these young coaches, <laughs> the Sean McVeighs, the Matt LaFleurs, all these guys that are out there that are supposed to be these top-notch young guns, and guess what? You get Bruce Arians and you get Andy Reid in the Super Bowl. <laughs> which shows you experience matters, coach. That experience does matter. The other thing that I took out of it, coach, was you got to take your hat off and you got to applaud Roger Goodell. You know, if you go back to the spring last year, you can remember even Kirk Herbstreit at ESPN said, I don't know if there's going to be a college football season or an NFL season. And then you look at Adam Schefter running around saying, oh, my God, how can you have a draft? There's carnage in the streets. Well, you know what happened? The NFL pulled it off and had a draft, and it was very successful. Even missing minicamp, even missing OTAs, even missing preseason, the NFL pulled it off without a hitch. Yeah, they had some hiccups along the road, but every team played a full season, and now we're at the Super Bowl. And I think for Roger Goodell in the NFL, that's a heck of a great sign of true, strong leadership in a crisis. I think it's also a – great tribute to the spirit of this country, Mark, that they want to move on with it. And they found a way to get it done. I agree with you completely.